Welcome everyone to a Khan Academy tutorial. This is Mr. West and we are covering a special right triangles today. Here we have in the right triangle shown, measure of angle V is 60, UV equals 18. How long is UW? All right, let's break down what a special right triangle this is. Okay, so we get a blue side. Let's make this one the blue side. Okay, we got our green side. Let's make this one a green side. All right, and then this is our longest side called the hypotenuse, and let's coordinate that. Okay, so this is our hypotenuse. This is our short side, and this is gonna be called our medium side. All right, I'll just call it MED for short. Now, a couple things. One, this is a 90 degree angle. It's always opposite the hypotenuse. The hypotenuse does not touch the 90 degree angle, okay? The next thing, oh, I should make that purple, shouldn't I? Yeah, make that purple. Okay, so this is our 90 degree angle. Oh, that's the eraser. There we go, 90 degree angle. Now, our medium side opposite that is a 60 degree angle, okay? So the, the medium angle, 60 degrees, corresponds to the medium side. It's not touching the angle. The angle points to it. That's how I like to call it. Some people don't like it. It opens up to the medium side. So lastly, we have this angle and we do 90 plus 60 is 150. Missing from our 180 degrees is 30. Our 30 degree angles corresponds to the short side of this triangle. This is a 30, 60, 90 degree triangle. It's a special right triangle because every one of these triangles has a special property. Whatever this side length for the short side, and we'll call it X. So whatever this length is, that was ugly. Okay, so we have X as our side length. Whatever that side length is, we take our hypotenuse and we double that X. So two times X is the length of our hypotenuse. So let me make it a little bit more clear. This is the length of that side. So two times whatever length that is, is gonna be our hypotenuse length in the 30, 60, 90 triangle. And then the medium side is going to be X times the square root of three. Okay, so that distance is going to be our medium side. The key here is that we are gonna use this X for all three sides, no matter what side length that is. So it's very important to always try to find that side length, um, but you can find all the other sides just based on one of these sides. With the Pythagorean theorem, you need two side lengths. You need at least a B, B, C, or a C. With a special 30, 60, 90 triangle, you only need one side length and you can find all the rest. How do I do that? Well. In this case, this is our hypotenuse. We know that the hypotenuse is two times, two times the short side is equal to our hypotenuse. So if we wanna find the short side, we just divide by two and we have our short side. So in this case, our hypotenuse was not, we had a value, it's 18. So we take 18, let's ask my eraser, I always do that. We take 18, divide by two, and we get my short side equals nine. It's half of it, okay? So if the hypotenuse is twice the size of my short side, then my short side is half the size of my hypotenuse. And that's how I know this is 30 degrees, but because of process of elimination, this is 90 degrees. Therefore, this one is gonna be, oh, sorry. This one is 60 degrees, okay? So now what do I do to find X? Well, I take my short side Okay, here's my little formula for that. I take my short side, my medium side, ugh, getting the colors wrong. My medium side is equal to my short side times radical three. Well, I know my short side is nine, so I just do nine radical three, and that's equal to my medium side. So medium side is equal to nine radical three nine radical three. So nine, nine radical three, and 18 are the side lengths. I'm looking for nine radical three. There it is. Okay, that's 30, 60, 90. That's the tough one. Here we have the second one. Okay, so this is a little bit longer video. This is called a 45, 45. <laughs> I hope you guys didn't see that. You did. Dang it, evidence for everyone to see. 45, 45, 90 triangle. How do I know it's 45, 45, 90? It's because this is isosceles, so these angles have to be equal. And if you do 180 minus 90 divided by two, you have 45. So each one of these is 45 degrees. 45, 45, 90. Now, the special property about 45, 45, 90 
is that you can take the short side, we'll call this one the short side, and then we'll call this one the long side, or hypotenuse. So the hypotenuse is equal to the short side times radical three. Okay, so that's what we do. The short side times radical three will be the length of the hypotenuse. Okay, so uh, if we take the short side, we know that's three, and we multiply it by radical three, we have the hypotenuse, and that's, oh, it's not radical three, sorry. Erase that, ignore what I said, it's radical two. Radical two, very important distinction. 3690 incorporates radical three, 45-45-90 incorporates through radical 2. So again, that's how we do hypotenuse is through radical 2. Okay, I'm going to reference that. If you want to go back and like pause that, that'd be great. Here we have a 3690, so we need to reference our 3690 triangle again. Here we go. Let's call this, well, hold on, hold on, back up, back up. Let's just do this. Here's the short side. How do I know that that's the short side? It's because the, sh the short, the small angle is over here and it's 30 degrees. I know this one is my medium side. Why do I know it's my medium side? Because this has got to be 60 degrees. So that's my medium side. I don't really care about my medium side. All I care about is the hypotenuse right there. I know it's the hypotenuse because it's opposite 90 degrees. My hypotenuse is equal to two times my short side. So all I got to do is take my short side, which is eight, and then times by two, and I got my hypotenuse. So my hypotenuse is equal to 16. Right there, boom, double. Okay, here we go. Hope it's another, oh my gosh, 3690, they're really killing it. All right, this is gonna be a little bit tougher because it incorporates six radical two. It's just to confuse you with the 45, 45, 90 uh, degree triangle. Okay, so this one's 30, 60, 90, so we need to label our sides first. Here's my small angle, here's my short side. Here's my medium side. Okay, so this one's my medium side. Now, how do I go from medium, uh, short to medium? Well, my medium side is equal to my short side times radical three, okay? So I know my short side is six radical two, and then I have to multiply this still by radical three to have it equal my medium side. So my medium side is equal to six, and then I multiply underneath the radicals, two times three, as you can combine underneath the radicals like that. So six radical six is gonna be my answer, letter D. So there we have it, special right triangles. Hopefully, you'll be hearing that sound 100%. Hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to check out other videos if you're having trouble. And I look forward to seeing you next time on this channel. Take care.